Hello. Uh, welcome back to Surface Noise. My name is John. Um, today will be vinyl update number 25, I believe. Um, this is all used stuff, mostly from an auction. A um, lot of stuff, a lot of stuff to get through. Um, pretty cool, a lot of good stuff, a lot of nice, interesting, cool stuff from 60s, 70s, 80s. Um, and uh, I'll start showing it off right after this. And we're back. Um, so, I'll try to go pretty quick. There's a lot of stuff and I don't want this video to go on for an hour. So, I will get right to it. So, I'll start off. I got a few, few 45s that I picked up. Um, I'll start with those. First, we got the Bruce Springsteen Dancing in the Dark. Pick actual sleeve in a in the picture sleeve. That's pretty cool. I remember this when it came out. I was very young, but I remember it. Uh, next up, this is Junior's Farm. Paul McCartney and Wings, I guess. Yeah, Paul McCartney and Wings on Apple. Pretty cool. With uh, B-side is Sally G. Right there. Um, and we got Elton John. This is Honky Cat. Um, and move quickly. Elvis Presley. Blue Christmas. B-side is Santa Claus is back in town. I prefer Blue Christmas, but hey. Um, and then we have Rolling Stones on the London label. Let's spend the night together beside Ruby Tuesday. Pretty cool. Now let's get into the big records. This filled a lot of holes in my collection with this, I will be honest. Uh, first we got Breakfast in America, Super Tramp. Next up, Slade, Slade. This has Mama We're All Crazy Now on it. Great record. First Slade record I've ever owned. Really cool. Next up, Asia. This is the one that has Heat of the Moment and what's the other one on here? Only Time Will Tell. Those are the two songs that I remember from Asia. Of course, this has Steve Howe, I believe. Yeah. Kind of a, I think it was kind of like a super group. Of guys from 70s bands and stuff. Um, next up, ABC, Alphabet City from the 80s. This is the one that had When Smokey Sings on it. Pretty good tune. Oh, this is really cool. This is a box set. This is Keith Jarrett, Solo Concerts. This is jazz. Um, this is the so Germany. It's from Germany, I believe. It was, I think this is German pressing. Uh, ECM label, I think. Anyway, this is, I listened to the first record of this and it's awesome. So I'm super happy with this. This is really cool. Um, next up, Pete Townsend. Empty Glass? Empty Glass. This has Rough Boys on it, which is an awesome song. And Let My Love Open the Door. Two great songs on here. So, great. First, uh, first Townsend record. I have The Who, but not Townsend. Then we have uh, T-Rex, Tanks. Um, and this is my first T-Rex album. So this is cool, nice to have. Uh, next up, a couple sticks albums. We got Grand Illusion, which has, what's on there? Come Sail Away is on this one. And then we have Pieces of Eight, which has Renegade, another awesome tune. Okay, I told you this is pretty cool. Um, Pink Floyd, The Wall, another one of the few I don't have, actually. I, I got a couple still to get, but this is was definitely a, a missing piece in my Pink Floyd collection. Um, next up, we got Leon Russell, Americana. Moving right along, we got Yellow's Greatest Hits. This would have been, I think, the early stuff. But um, I haven't had a chance to listen yet, but I'm sure it's awesome. Then we got Split Ends, Frenzy. I have one other Split Ends, so it's nice to add that in. This is kind of interesting. Al Jolson, and this is a 10-inch record. I'm gonna maybe just pull that one out for a sec. Ooh. You see that? That's pretty cool. I'm not sure I'm a big Al Jolson guy, but this is kind of a neat, at least, piece of history for sure. Um, Paul McCartney. Tug of War. I absolutely loved this album when I was a kid. 
Um, it has ebony and ivory on it, but my song I think that I like the most was Wanderlust. So, right there. Uh, this is good. This is Mothers of Invention. Uh, I think this is one is called Absolutely Free. Uh, cover's a bit trashed, but the record's in good condition. Um, this is pretty wild. Uh, yeah, it's 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 in, it's pl definitely playable. Um, good to have to, for my first anything related to Zappa, so that's that's awesome. Um, Best of Bread, that's the next one. Uh, yeah, I'm not. I know Bread not intimately, but you know, good to have uh, greatest hits. Uh, Eddie Money, with of course two tickets to paradise. So. My first Eddie Money record, too. All right. Um, just take a brief second here to say, if you're enjoying this, um, if you would like and subscribe, I would certainly appreciate it. It would certainly help grow the channel. Um, and with that said, I will continue. Um, next up, we have, this covers trash, too, but this is Cindy Lauper. Uh, is this True Colors? True Colors, yeah. So you... I think that's the big uh, the big song here was True Colors. I don't know if I knew anything else off this, but now I have two Cindy Lauper albums. That's kind of neat. Oh, that's in the wrong spot. Right there, um, this is Falco, which has Rock Me Amadeus on it. Two versions actually. For someone this is yeah. Anyway, right there. Um, then we got some Rod Stewart. Tonight I'm Yours. I remember this one. This came out too. Um, Young Turks is on here. And Tonight I'm Yours. Uh, it's two of the singles on that. Um, now we got three here. This is... So this is Steppenwolf, the second. And this is Steppenwolf for ladies only. And this is just Steppenwolf. So I have a bit of a collection all of a sudden. Nice, nice, nice. Um, next up, we got, this is Katie Lang. I believe this is with her band. Yes. Yeah. Katie Lang and the Reclines, Absolute Torch and Twang. Again, my first Katie Lang ever. This I was very happy to get again. Um, this is Cargo, Men at Work. Um, I have two copies of the first album, but this is a... Really good. I really love this. Uh, I was a big, big guy for Men at Work when they came out. Um, it's another addition to the Stones collection. The cover is pretty trash, but I think it's the first live Stones I have. But yeah, it's a, it's, it's iffy, but um, yeah, still need to have. Oh, uh, next up, finally got uh, some of this. This is yes. Close, closer, close to the edge, close to the edge. So I have two Yes albums, so that's pretty cool. Now we have Little River Man, Greatest Hits. Uh, I have a bunch all of a sudden of Little, Little River Man. That's like my fourth or fifth record, so that was quick. <laughs> um, then we have Rick Springfield, and this is his big record with Jesse's Girl on it. And it also has I've Done Everything For You, I think it's called, yeah. I remember those two songs. Jesse's Girl, obviously the big one. So, Next up, more McCartney. This is McCartney. Again, on this one, the cover is a, the, a little bit trashed, but uh, the record's in decent shape. So, you know, it's playable anyway. That's that. Um, then we got some 80s pop air supply, the one that you love. Uh -huh. I got some soundtracks next. Um, this is uh, Mike's Murder. I kind of remember the soundtrack more than the film, but it's uh, Joe Jackson, so that alone is worth you know checking out. Then we've got Top Gun, of course, with some Kenny Loggins on here. Pretty cool. Uh, what's up next? Oh, we got more good '80s stuff. Miami Vice soundtrack. Probably a lot of Glenn Fry on here, I'm assuming. Yeah. 
Another soundtrack is St. Elmo's Fire. The only one I know, I think, is the title track. I don't think anything else was that big off of this, but yeah. We got the, the, the brat pack in here. <laughs> okay, moving right along. Got some Tony Basil with Mickey. And I don't know any other song by Tony Basil but Mickey. I actually have the 12 inch of, of Mickey, but now I have the album too. That's pretty cool. This is neat. Golden Hits of the Everly Brothers. Very nice. Um, Christopher Cross. This would have been his debut, I guess, right? Or is it? No, I don't know. This is a different album. Oh, no, this is it. This is the first album. Yeah, it's got Sailing on it. I wasn't sure. Yeah, nice to have. Oh... We got some Ted Nugent, Free For All, Free For All. Don't know, really know this record, but yeah. He likes his, he likes his guitar, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, we got some more Maul McCartney. It is Wings at the Speed of Sound. And another, another Joni Mitchell record. This, uh, I don't really recognize the songs in here, but I'll have to give this a listen. I do have her. I think I have Ladies of the Canyon as the other one I have of hers. Um, we're almost done here. Moody Blues. So I got more Moody Blues now. I think I'm up to like five or six now. This is To Our Children's Children's Children. Pretty cool. Nice to have. And we're going to wind up with a good. Canadian band. This is Trooper, and this album is two for the show. Um, Boys and the Bright White Sports Car is on here, and yeah. I think the only other one I have of theirs was uh, Hot Shots, which is like the greatest hits, I think. So, so um, that's it. That's at least the highlights of what I got. I did get some more stuff, but it's it's almost too much to like do all in one video. That, that's that's the really good stuff though so um hope you enjoyed seeing what i got um i uh yeah it's it's a lot of stuff uh, i'm gonna be listening to this for months and months and months it's gonna take a while but i'm happy to have gotten it i hope you enjoyed seeing it um if you did like i mentioned earlier you can like and subscribe i also have a website surfacenoise.ca you can check that out i'll put a link in the description um, hope everyone's having a good weekend and I will uh, see you all in the next video.